Josh takes out a $22,800 student loan to pay his expenses while he is in college. After graduation, he will begin making payments of $163.35 per month for the next 20 years to pay off the loan. Complete the following steps to determine how much more Josh will end up paying for the loan than the original amount of $22,800. So the first question is how much did Josh borrow? That's part of the given information. He borrowed $22,800. Next, how much will he be paying back a month? That's also given. He'll be paying $163.35 a month. Next, if he is paying monthly for 20 years, how many payments will he make? Since there are 12 months in a year, and he's paying for 20 years, 12 times 20 will tell us how many total months there are in 20 years, and also how many payments he will end up making. So 12 times 20 equals 240. So if he makes all the payments, he'll make a total of 240 payments. If he makes that many payments, how much money will he pay in total? He'll be making 240 payments of $163.35, and therefore 240 times $163.35 will give us the total amount paid over the 20 years. For this, let's use our calculator. 240 times 163.35 is equal to 39,204. So Josh will end up paying a total of $39,204. And then finally, how much more will Josh end up paying for the loan than the original value of $22,800? Well, he's gonna end up paying $39,204. And if we subtract the amount of the loan, 22,800, This will tell us the cost of the loan. So we have four minus zero, that's four. Zero minus zero. Here we'll perform an exchange. 12 minus eight is four. And eight minus two is six. And three minus two is one. So Josh will end up paying $16,404. More than he borrowed to pay off the loan. I hope you found this helpful.